Id's last game was built on Id Tech 5. We're now bringing out Id Tech 6 to build the new Doom. Uh, what are the goals of the new engine? Our internal kind of fundamental goal is to be the best looking uh, tech at 60 hertz. Um, you know, 60 frames per second is really important to us. Uh, the, the other big goal of this uh, that differentiates it from Id Tech 5 would be that this is, uh, Doom is a very dynamic world. Uh, dynamic lighting is back, and um, we really enjoyed working on Rage and, 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 and building a Tech 5, but we really needed to go fully dynamic again uh, uh, for Doom. So 60, 60 hertz yeah. at 1080p, if anybody's taking notes. That's, that was my <laughs> next question. Yeah, six, so 60 frames per second? Yes. 1080p? That's it. We have an, uh, just probably the best tech team we've ever had at it. I mean, it's just, it, it's really impressive to watch what these guys have done. Even leading up to, to, to right before we were getting the demos done, uh, they, were, they were putting in features. Um, it, it, is a, it is a physically based rendering. We have a, a whole new way of, of um, detailing out the world with, uh, with a decal system that was added. Um, and uh, and you kinda, you're, you're seeing a, 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 big, a big piece of that. It's actually an entirely new rendering engine from what we showed at QuakeCon last year. So yeah. if you were at QuakeCon, the, the 3,000 people that got to see that there, um, you know, definitely check out these, uh, these videos because it is a, a, a big step from, uh, from where we were even then. And, and I think that's a, it's a testament to our team, just how, how, how much they've done in the course of the last nine months.